Hello and welcome to yet another YouTube video here on this channel. Today I am giving you seven all-in-one productivity apps. So these are apps that you can use for all of your productivity from calendars to to-do lists to note-taking. These apps have them all. And the first one I'm going to mention here is probably the best note-taking app ever made. And this one is called Obsidian. You've probably heard of it before. So that's the first one, Obsidian. The second app we have is called Cuan Notes, still not pronouncing that correctly, but this is quite similar to something like Obsidian, but it has a lot more base functionality without plugins uh, compared to Obsidian. It has community plugins as well, which are good, but all of them are in Chinese and I can't seem to read Chinese. Uh, overall, this app is quite new and it has been one of my favorites ever since I tried it out. Uh, it is still quite new, so it needs a bit more development, but this is a great option, especially if you're going away from something like Notion for privacy issues, or if you're an any type user that unhappy with the development of uh, any type. The next one is Notion. You can't make an all-in-one productivity app without mentioning Notion. This is probably the best one for a casual productivity nerd. I would call them a casual productivity nerd. Obsidian is sort of more nerdy, I would say, or more niche. Uh, so I would probably love something like Obsidian, but Notion is a lot more mainstream. And with the amount of tutorials out there, it is getting easier to learn. Uh, I used Notion for such a long time and I still have a lot inside of Notion. There are a few problems with it that I am not going into in this video, uh, but Notion is an option for people who want an all-in-one productivity app and just having one app that could do it all. The next one on my list is actually Tooze, and I honestly love this app so much. It is and will probably forever be my favorite app. It has a uh, to do functionality and I had this thing where I had if I had a to do coming up I would place it let's say 31st October I would place it inside of here and on that day I would always get a reminder because I always checked my daily lists so I knew when everyone at work was going to travel I knew everyone's deadlines everything just seems so simple. I have transitioned to using physical pen and paper, but I still use twos to jot down a lot of my different ideas. It has calendar functionality as well. It allows you to actually review your lists, which is something I can't understand why other note-taking apps don't do. So this is probably the best option if you don't want to think too much about your productivity you just want to be productive this is probably the best app for you taskade is another great productivity app which never have gotten any type of hype a lot of these productivity apps gain a lot of hype for a short period then people jump over to the next thing it's the shiny new tool syndrome which i have struggled with a lot but Taskade have never got that sort of attention. Even though the app is really good, so you have your tasks, it has AI, which is quite good, uh, and it calls itself AI-powered second brain for teams, but I have used it as uh, a single person, and it works quite well. You have a lot of different views inside of here, so you can do mind maps, you can have boards, you can have calendar views actions there are there are quite a few opportunities and if you work in a team you also have the chat here so you can chat with your uh with the people on your team it has a great chatbot ai uh, we can just try it out for the purpose of this video um as you can see it actually does quite a impressive job at laying out the steps here so it has a great ai as well 
and it doesn't seem to stop. Uh, but it has a great AI and overall is a great app if you want to be productive. This is probably a lot better for people who take uh, bullet points as notes. I would take long form notes inside of this. So if you're into outlining and you want to try out an all-in-one productivity app, Taskade is a great option. Another great option is ClickUp, and ClickUp has had a few problems with uh, stability, but it seems to have gotten better now with the release of ClickUp 3.0. It is great for having your different tasks, and it also has a calendar view for blocking out your time, so you could actually drag your tasks into here and block out your time. And you can do that days ahead as well. So it has calendar functionality, to-do list functionality, an inbox feature. You can keep track of your goals and you can have different spaces inside of here. So ClickUp is probably better as a project manager. So if you tend to work on a lot of projects or you categorize a lot of your to-dos as projects. For example, I have this YouTube channel and every video is a project, so I do a lot of projects. If you're uh, one of those who tend to work in more projects, this is probably the best apps. Just like, just like Taskade, it has a lot of different views from Kanban to Calendar and you can even add more views and there are quite a few to choose from. So if you're into projects and you do a lot of projects, ClickUp is probably one of the best apps out there for you, so do try it out. The last app I'm going to show you is actually called AnyType and it is quite similar to See You on Notes, and a blend between something like Notion and Obsidian. It has a privacy focus, but you get a lot of the feature set that you have inside of Notion. Uh, and I honestly like this app a lot, but databases and just too much customizability isn't for me because I tend to do more customization than actual work, as I've said many times before. And I'm not too into all-in-one productivity solutions, but if you wanted something like Notion, but privacy is really important to you, then any type is one of your best options. And I will end this video off with ranking all of the different ones. So I would place Obsidian as number one, simply because it is the best and it will be the best for a long time. I would place CU on notes as number two. I would place twos as number three. Notion as 4, Taskade as 5, ClickUp as 6, and AnyType as 7. Or rather, I would place AnyType as 6 and ClickUp as 7. That would probably be my conclusion. All of these apps are great choices. I have ranked them based on how I think they would perform as um, an all-in-one solution. For example, Two's app is probably one of the best uh, at handling to-dos, while Notion is probably one of the best at handling um, handling projects, just like ClickUp and Taskade are. And AnyType and Obsidian are probably, with CU on Notes, the best at privacy, but I've tried to give them a total rank and rank them of one to seven. My favorite in this list is probably twos, my personal favorite, but objectively I think Obsidian is the best app. Thank you so much for watching today's video. If you have any questions, please do leave them down below and I hope to see you again or I hope you will see me again quite soon.